It's her second turn of the game only, and Pegasus is about to dominate the field of ecology. She did so well in CO2. Actually, not that much better than the other people, but just well enough to be considered to be a champion in ecology. All right, one, two, three, four. Bicycle, 50 miles to work, win bet, 1,000 times roll of one die. It's just a bike bicycle 50 miles back. That's 100 miles in one day. That's a lot. So $2,000 she gets. And I guess I'll, I'll just do this part for a little while by myself, and then I'll talk to you about it. Checking in uh, with the nugget that Pegasus won the exact same bet again. $2,000 she got for betting that she could ride to and from work 50 miles on a bike. Though maybe, maybe she gets a bus back, or maybe she has her car left there so she rides her car back with a, something to carry her bike in. Um, I'll go again. One, two, three, four. Take Girl Scouts on litter walk. Two hearts. I, don't know, I guess that makes you happy. Whatever makes you happy, Pegasus. Go for that. So going through this track, we find that it's not super efficient in terms of what you get. There's a lot of two heart spaces that Pegasus landed on. That's the same as if you just hang out in Hawaii. But there are some better ones than that. So it's better to spend your time in ecology than hanging out in Hawaii, given assuming you can do it as long as Pegasus can. So how did she end up? She got 30 hearts all told, which is quite a bit. 16 fame, she needs to get 30. So she got half her fame goal overshot her heart goal and got $4,000 in the mix. And that took her how many turns? She got, took her a lot of turns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So now she's at turn 10, which is ahead of just about everyone. Uh, landed on a college space. She might jump in on a college. She could try to be a doctor. I think she could be a doctor or a historian. Probably go for the doctor degree. So Banana so far has, has landed on this space three times and the bicycle space one time, got 1,000 from that. So she had 16,000, then she landed on this thing, which made her, she got caught littering and lost half her cash on hand. That's really rough on her, um, but not too bad because she doesn't really care that much for money. Uh, in fact, not at all. So money would just be a way to get other things. So not that rough. Um, plus she's still up 8,000. Not as many hearts as she'd like. Let's see where she ends up. One, two, three, four, five. Opportunity knocks, and she's going to get an experience. Oh, she can go to college. I think she will. She has an experience as well. Great. I think a bit of karma hit Destructo. He um, had an all right run. Got some, got some money, some happiness, and some fame, although he doesn't need the fame. Um, Almost almost to his goal, two-fifths of the way of the goal. No, I guess not almost. But then he ended up in hospital, which is not good. He has some experience cards, though. Got some experience out of it, and that's nice. But he's still in the hospital. Little Red did all right. He ended up with 14 happiness, needs to get 50. Got some money. He spent a 1000 of it on a new car after he got out of the ecology business, um, which is nice for him. Oh, I didn't even take account of that heart he got. The, he spent $1,000 on a car, and all it did was increase his happiness by one point. Think about that next time you're car shopping. Dick had a fairly modest run through, got uh, eight happiness out of the 60 he's going for there, you see. Um, but then he ended up with the opportunity to go into college, and he's pretty early in the turn. He's only had five turns in the game. So how I'm going to run this is... I'm gonna do my whole thing with averaging the, um, the turns that people have had in the different groups. And whichever average is earliest is gonna go first, as long as provided the average is before five. I guess I should let Watermelon, maybe let these people find where they wanna go first. Maybe I should do that first. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'll do that first. I'll let, I'll let Little Red Destructo and Watermelon play. So scratch what I just said, Never mind. So if you call watermelon, recall watermelon fell and I didn't know where she was. Um, I found that she had a golden opportunity card, however, to enter the entrance square of her space and I had her choose artists um, because it met with her goals uh, and she could afford it. And then I started averaging out their turn order to get 
get the number here. This number was already here, and this is the correct number. So I wonder if she didn't actually end up here, and I didn't write it down, but I, for some reason, uh, averaged it out properly. Or maybe the average was the same whether or not she was with them. I don't know. But she's in the right place now. She's an artist. Destructo decided to just sit out until after he got there, until people caught up. He knows that if you just go around the board wasting turns, um, you're not going to win this game. So he's waiting for someone to, to come out who has the money or the inclination to make a trade so that he can get directly into an occupation and start doing better and avoid all these kind of silly spaces that aren't that good a use of time. It's all about work in careers. Um, Little Red, he promptly got the Great Mountain Climber card and joined the sporting friends here. So he's going to be doing sports in a while. It's going to be a few games before we get to that. That's 5.6 on average. Engineering's next, 3.8. That's going to mean I'm going to need to spend some time learning some games or whatever game I end up playing uh, next time on the Real People Multigame Solitaire Mega Tournament English slash Pasha dash Rue Leg 2.